Hi, I'm Jeremy from International Sportsman. Today we're looking at the Kodiak Outdoor Blanket. Now about a year ago, I saw this in the SHOT Show preview and reached out to them because it has some really unique features for the outdoorsman, the hunter, people that fish, people that just wanna spend time in the outdoors and stay warm. So we're gonna dive in and take a look at the Kodiak Blanket. So in order to understand why I was so intrigued about this blanket, we have to go back to their first product, which is called the Cozy. That's an indoor slash outdoor blanket, but what's unique about it is that it is battery powered and heated. Now the battery pack provides a lot of juice. So it's just under 100 watt hours, which allows you to bring it inside an airplane's carry on for those chilly flights. Okay, the story behind how this blanket was invented is really unique. So the founder of the blanket had a daughter that has cerebral palsy and she has poor blood circulation. Well, they want to do outdoor activities with her, but they need to keep her warm during the colder months. So they invented the Cozy. However, what's different about the Kodiak is that it's designed for hard use in the outdoors. It's available in two colors, camo, this mossy oak camo, and a slate color here. It's designed to wrap yourself up in, but it is also just a great outdoor blanket. It's more rugged and durable than the Cozy, and the measurements come in at 72 inches by 60 inches. So it's big enough to completely wrap yourself up in and stay warm. A couple of things about the Kodiak blanket. First, it heats up very quickly. You'll start feeling heat within the first five minutes. The battery pack will last just under two hours with the default settings. You can adjust the heat setting to either medium or low, and this will increase the battery life for that charge. If you have a second battery pack, you can get a combined total of four plus hours of continuous heat. Number two, you can charge your electronics off of the battery pack and the battery pack stays charged for up to six months. So you can put this in the trunk of your car, you can store it, and you don't have to worry about charging it up constantly. Now they do recommend that you top it off, obviously before you use it, but the fact that this battery lasts so long is one of the great features about it. So we're gonna dive in and take a look at how exactly to use the Kodiak blanket and what it does. The Kodiak comes in a very durable, weather-resistant bag that has carry handles and a shoulder strap. On the inside of the bag, it has a pocket on the left and the right. Now on the left-hand side is what holds the battery pack, and then on the right-hand side, you have a pocket that holds your charging cables for the car, as well as you know the wall outlet. Now looking at the blanket itself, if you look at the top of the blanket where the Kodiak symbol is, you'll see on the inside that there are two pockets. These are handholds so that when you wrap yourself up in it, you can snuggle up nice and warm with it. At the bottom of the blanket, which is completely opposite of the handholds, you have the pocket where the battery goes into. So there's a little cable that comes out and the battery just plugs into this cable. To plug it in, simply remove the rubber piece from the battery, plug it into the charge port there for the blanket, press the power button and hold that down. Once the battery pack is turned on, it will automatically go into search mode. If you'd like the blanket to get even warmer, you can turn the battery off and back on again to surge it a second time. If you surge it once, the battery pack will last just under two hours. If you surge it twice, the battery pack will last an hour and a half. Now, because it has twice the amount of wire as the Cozy, you might want to surge it twice, but if you don't want to do that, you'll get longer battery life. After the blanket has surged and heated up, it will automatically drop down to the high setting. Now to get the maximum benefit from the Kodiak, make sure and wrap yourself up in it tightly and don't have any gaps, otherwise some heat could escape. So as I mentioned, the Kodiak was designed for outdoor use, and here are just a few of the examples of how you can use the Kodiak blanket. So you can use it in the deer stand, right? On those cold mornings, cold afternoons, when you're out hunting, you can wrap yourself up in it, stay warm. It's very quiet, so you're not gonna have the rustling or the noise factor that you would get, you know, from some clothing that makes a lot of noise that would scare the animals off. 
So this is especially useful for those people that have poor circulation in their legs and want to stay warm. Of course, it can be an extra layer that you can easily take off and use when you start to shoot. Or if you're using a bow, I mean, no matter how you hunt, you can use this blanket. If you're sitting in a tree stand, you're more exposed to the elements. So it's a waterproof blanket, it's windproof, and it helps keep you warm during those cold months. If you think about it, instead of buying extra layers that you have to take on, take off, using a blanket for a hunting scenario makes a lot of sense. On a boat, you can use the blanket to quickly warm up after swimming, diving, or fishing. You don't have to worry about getting wet. So what happens is, is that when you come out of the water, your poor body temperature is low. Well, you could wrap yourself up in a blanket, but then you'd have to depend on your own body heat to warm yourself up. Well, if you have the Kodiak and you have it surged up and hot, you can just wrap yourself up and get warm quickly. Not only does this make it more comfortable for small kids and people that want to get warm quickly after enjoying the lake, it also helps you stay dry and protects you from the wind and everything while you're out boating. Another great use that we found for this blanket was at sporting events. So not only does it protect you from the cold bench that you're sitting on, but you can also wrap yourself up in it and stay protected from the cold, especially during those long sporting events when the sun goes down, it gets very cold on those bleachers, but you can wrap yourself up in the Kodiak blanket and stay nice and warm. Now, since it is a rugged hunting blanket, it works very well for dogs too. So they don't necessarily recommend that you use it in the heating section for dogs without supervision. So I wouldn't just turn it on and, and let a dog lay on it without keeping an eye on them. But dogs love how comfortable this blanket is. It's very soft on the inside. It's durable and rugged and waterproof on the outside. So you can use it in the back of your truck to keep the dog's nails from scratching up your seats. Or you can use it inside as just a soft place for your dog to stay. Now, as you know, Dogs get cold after hunting or, you know, little dogs get cold all the time. So this is a great way to keep your pet happy and comfortable in this blanket. Now, I think one of the most unique features that I hadn't thought about living in Texas is using this blanket in your emergency kit, in your car, your camper, your RV, something like that. So in the Northern states where it gets really cold and there's a high probability of getting snowed in, you can leave this in the trunk of your car, and then if you get stuck, pull it out, wrap yourself up, and stay warm. Now, since the battery life lasts for over six months in storage, you can secure it in your car and know that you're gonna have power to stay warm. Now, it does include a car adapter to keep that battery running and to keep you warm even longer. So that's a look at the Kodiak Blanket. Really, it has a ton of applications for just about any outdoor activity. It's waterproof, it's machine washable, it's extremely rugged, and it's going to last you a very long time. Personally, I've always been a proponent of using blankets instead of sleeping bags when camping, and I'm looking forward to using the Kodiak this winter when it gets super cold. Guys, if you want to learn more about the Kodiak, make sure and check out our companion article on internationalsportsman.com. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. We'd really appreciate that. And we'll see you next time.